Hey guys, uh, I want to show you uh, in this video how you can um, make a geometric tattoo sleeve just like this. Pretty fast and pretty easy. Um, this is my way, you can do it uh, in a lot of ways. Um, I will uh, create a download link so you can download everything I use in the video for free. It's in the description of the video. So let's go. Okay, so first open the picture that I will uh, add in the uh, item description so you can download it. Then um, I will start almost every time if I make a full sleeve, I will start at the shoulder or at the wrist. So you have an end point. So in this case, I will start at the shoulder. I will pick a flower for that. Create a new layer and add the flower. I'm going to rotate it a little to make it fit on the shoulder. That's nice. And now we will erase all the parts outside of the arm. I will just use the eraser that comes with Procreate, in this case the hot airbrush. Erase everything outside of the arm. Like that. We will add some leaves. So you don't have to worry about um, picking the leaves because I will just uh, add them in, uh, in one brush set so you can install it. The size about 25, 20 to 25. A new layer, add it, rotate it, make it a little bigger, maybe there, and then duplicate it. We're gonna flip that one. So that's um, the arrow and then flip horizontal. Maybe there. Then we can um, merge down. So you have the, both of the leaves on one uh, layer and then we will erase again. So erase everything outside of the arm. And then we will erase the parts behind the flowers because the flower is on top of the leaves. Like so. Then next, um, I like to put a mandala on the elbow. Most of the times that uh, works very well. So a new layer. And then you will pick the mandala that I will add in the item description. Yeah. and put the center of the mandala on the elbow so the size is about 25 now we cannot see the mandala here on the background so we will just erase the parts that we see I'm not going to worry about that too much I want to keep the video short, so I'm not going to uh, worry too much about the details. I just want to show you how you can make a um, tattoo sleeve in a really fast way. Now for the bottom part, I'm going to use uh, Lotus. These are all designs that I made over the years, so over 15 years. I kept every design. The 
first new layer, I forgot. Now we will um, use the center of the lower arm to align it. We will erase the parts underneath the mandala, so lower the opacity so you can see the mandala. And erase everything underneath it. Later on we will add some shading to create more contrast. Turn up the opacity again. Okay, that's nice. Now for this part we will add some um, geometric pattern. It is in my uh, sacred geometry uh, brush set. I will go with number four. Uh, use the select tool, make sure it is on freehand and select everything where you want the pattern to be. So just draw it, go over the lines. Okay, we will erase this part where the leaf is. So now make a new layer and just draw it in. Lower the opacity because we will erase that part. So now you have a, a basic layout for a sleeve, but we need more contrast. So first, uh, I think the pattern is too dark, so we will erase some parts of that. So duplicate the pattern layer, turn off the uh, top one, and we're gonna lower the opacity of the bottom one, maybe around 40. Then turn on the top one and now we will erase some parts and I think it will be nice to leave the, um, uh, the, the, the bigger shapes dark and the other shapes light so we will erase all those tiny parts. And it's nice if you show this to a customer, the design, that you also tattoo it like this. So the way I will do it is just tattoo all these parts, black, solid black. And the lighter parts you can uh, do it in different ways. You can do some fine dots. You can do some um, shading as well, but me personally, I like to um, use um, like a seven liner and just uh, dot it. But that's really a matter of taste. So normally I would take uh, more time for this, but now I'm going to work a little bit quicker to keep the video short. 
Over here, I made a little mistake. I will uh, draw it in. Okay. So this is much nicer, I think. Now we will add some uh, shading. First, the uh, mandala is a little bit too light, so I will darken that. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's put some uh, shading in. Uh, turn the opacity around 50 and the size about 10. We're going to do some drop shadow from the mandala on the lotus design. So on a separate layer, just draw some shading in. Go from light to dark. And then we will er erase everything we don't want. The opacity a little bit down. Okay, now we will add some shading on the flower. Not too much. Just make it a little bit more interesting. So always shade on the on the part underneath the other parts, if that makes uh, any sense. It was a little bit too dark. Yeah, that's better. So you just keep shading and erasing. And I only use this to give my customer an uh, idea of how the sleeve will be. And if you're going to tattoo this, you just work the same as designing it on Procreate. So for example, if you want to print out this uh, pattern, just uh, create a new uh, file in uh, Procreate, draw it in, print it out, and um, with a Sharpie you will sketch on the skin. And in that way you um, can transfer, transfer the whole design on the body. So I will uh, keep it. At this point, I like it. 
if you want to uh, see more, uh, if you want me to make something uh, different, just let me know in the comments and I will make more videos. I will try to make more time to create videos. Uh, follow me on Instagram, check out my Etsy shop, follow me on YouTube and uh, I will see you again. Thank you. Bye.